Hello everyone, I am the Criminal Archer, and welcome to Medusa's Labyrinth. Medusa's Labyrinth is a first-person horror game that was sent to me by Guru Games. Uh, I believe they're from Sweden. Um, it just sort of arrived in my inbox. I looked, watched the trailer, thought it looked neat, figured I'd give it a shot. Um, it's set in ancient Greece, in a sort of, you know, mythical times. I assume it has something to do with Medusa, and the Labyrinth part makes me assume that it has something to do with the Minotaur. So, let's dive in. See what happens. <clears throat> I'm hoping for something creepy. Mighty Poseidon, Lord of the Black Depths, swirling dark and deep, whose will shapes the currents of fate, save thy servant, break open the earth, and let sweet waters spring forth. Pull me with the tide, grant me safe harbor at last, and shield me from the storm that approaches. Oh, just barely made that. <clears throat> Alright, so let's see. We're near some sort of big temple-y thing. Assume that's probably the only way to go. Let's run down here real quick. Doubt there's anything to see. Nope, nothing to see. Alright, we'll head back. Doesn't strike me as the kind of game that has a lot of stuff hidden in corners to be found. Alright, uh, interact, highlighted options, right, left mouse button. Alonia, part one of eight. Father told me he had a great news today, but he did not sound pleased. He said I had been chosen, that I was to serve in the temple as an oracle. I've always felt that I did not belong in the kitchens, but Mother never let me see anything else. Dirty pans and pots all day. I prayed to him, and now my God has answered. Why can't Father be happy for me? I guess Father probably knows something you don't, kiddo. And now we're just going to head up here. Nice full moon tonight. Good luck. Anything in the cart worth looking at? Nope, nothing in the cart. Let's see. Let's keep going. Keep on keeping on, I guess. Some bricks. Oh, here's another note. Today is the day they take me to the temple. Father said I could not call him father anymore, and that no one in th at the temple can know about him and mother. I have a bruise on my shoulder where his fingers dug in, the, in when he grabbed me. The acolytes should come by sunset, he said, and I should not worry. But I do worry. I've never seen that look in his eyes before. Alright. Oh, look. The leaves are falling. It's kind of a neat effect. Oh. Oh, no. I feel like that's a bad sign. Don't announce my presence, Mr. Bell. I don't want anybody to know I'm here. Oh, what's this guy? Is that Medusa? Medusa turn you into stone? I understand. It'll probably happen to me soon. Alright. Oh. I think I see a Minotaur statue up there. That uh, leads me to believe that we will be running into a Minotaur at some point. Yeah, you're gonna eat my face, aren't you? All right, let's see. I guess we'll just head into the temple. There's a note here. It's from Arcus. Two of five. I guess we missed one somewhere. She is to become his body and soul. Chosen by fate, they told me. An oracle to see the future and grant blessings according to Poseidon's will. I won't let him take my beautiful daughter. I have seen what the Hierophant and his followers do to those poor girls in the sanctuary. Chosen, but for whom? Whose will to, is she to please? I still have some friends amongst the younger priests that pr promised to help. We're going to ambush them in the gardens and t get her away from the Hierophant's filthy fingers. But where to hide her? They look for her in the village, and she will not be safe anywhere near the water. Oh, my sweet daughter, why did you have to be like your mother? Beauty is not a blessing, but a curse upon the young. Alright, let's head on in. I have a feeling this is going to go great. <laughs> Ooh. Fancy pad. Somebody knocked over the plant. I bet I did that on the way in. I can be clumsy sometimes. Alright, nice bed. 
Fancy little shield thing on the wall. Another thing to read. Bologna, part three of eight. I'm not gonna be an oracle after all. Father came with some men and killed the priests. One of his friends got stabbed and I screamed. Father slapped me until I fell silent. He never hurt me before. It's high quality parenting. Then they dragged me away somewhere within the temple. They locked me in here with the wounded man. I hear his ragged breathing. There's bubbling sound when he exhales. They got blood all over my blue dress too. The one mother gave me on solstice day last summer. Wonder if it'll ever wash out. Eh, probably not. Alright, so what do we got here? It's got a mosaic of Poseidon, I guess. Oh, hello. Let's pull you. Alright. Oh, sandal. Anybody need sandals? Oh, there's another one. Nice set of sandals. Have them, take them with us. Yeah, yeah. you're right. Sandals are impractical footwear for or, uh, catacombs. Alright, let's head in here. Alright, well lit room, creepy room. Well lit room, creepy room. Well lit, creepy. Well lit, creepy. Yeah, let's go down creepy. Other rights. Okay. Nice amount of skulls on the table. Interesting motif. This is blocked. Can't go that way. That's nothing. Nice fire. Alright, I guess we're... Nothing down that room. Let's go this way. Duck under here. <laughs> Hold. Crouch. Press control to crouch. Alright, so we need to go one of these ways. Due to illness spreading among the servants, the eastern catacombs has been locked down and is under quarantine. The bridge leading to this area may not be lowered at any time by anyone unless explicitly ordered by the High Hierophant. Alright, let's go down this first. Take a quick look-see. See what we see. Mm, is that a bridge? I think that's a, like a drawbridge. I guess that's probably where we're heading eventually. Alright, uh, press and hold shift to sprint. Uh, I guess I'll run through this. Uh, run, 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 run. Okay, I guess that was just... I th thought maybe those creepy statues would get us. Got a room here. Nothing. Nothing. Okay. Oil lamps on the walls. Q and E to lean. Okay. Hopefully I can actually use that effectively. I'm usually not very good with leaning. I never know where, like, when you're actually, how far you're actually hidden. Back when I played Monstrum, it was always a problem. I was never sure if I was actually being seen by the monster around the corner or if when I was leaning or if I was safe. It was, yeah, it's all very confusing. Ooh, skulls. Is this a torch? Torch! Um, I don't like this. <clears throat> Alright, let's, uh, let's not be in here. Press and hold left mouse, left mouse button to light torch. Hey, there we go. Alright, our exit, our, our entrance disappeared. Guess we'll go out this way. Let's go in this room first. This room's not so bad. Can I just stay here? <laughs> this seems pleasant enough. I'm in Hades. It's dark here. I've not seen the light of the sun in days. The slaves father sent to guard me let their eyes linger longer than they should. It makes my skin crawl. Their master comes by now and then to leave supplies, but never stays long. They haven't acted upon the things I see in their mind but I can't sleep with them so close. I wish father was here. The whitewashed bones that fill these tunnels whisper to me, call for me to join them. I might take them up on their offer. Oh, that's not good. All right, we can add crazy girl to our list of um, things that are possibly in here to kill us. What do we got? This is to sleep. 
There's somebody coughing in the music. Torches will burn out. Oh, I don't like that. You? Can I get past you? No. No. Okay. Can I light these things? No, apparently not. Alright, what do we have here? Rubble. Uh, it's the same thing about illnesses. Whoops, that is not the key I want. What's down here? Actually, let's go this way first. What is there to see down here? The bridge again? Are we like doubled back on ourselves? Isn't that the same angle we saw the bridge at from before? Hmm. Oh, and now this is different behind us, too. Oh, creepy. That's just creepy. The place is rearranging itself. Left or right? Let's go right. I am a right-handed person. I tend to go right first. Alright, apparently that's just rubble. Alright, left it is. You know what this groove in the middle of the floor is supposed to be for? Alright, what do we have here? Arcus. I found a way to hide her from all of them, mortals and gods alike. Kirkalos and two of his slaves will watch over her down there. No one will look for her amongst the dead. I just hope that she will understand I do this to protect her. Ever since Tia must died, she's refused to talk to me. I probably should not have slapped her like that, but her scream would have ruined everything. Tia must's death was a hard blow for us all. For all of us. A slap is nothing in comparison, yes I wish it was undone. I long to hear her sweet laugh again, someday soon. When they've stopped looking, I'll make her smile like she used to. I guess that probably isn't going to work out for him. Okay, we got F to pick up the bow. Um, F, alright. And then I take the arrows. No, 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 don't do that. Don't shoot them. I want the arrows. There we go. That's T to pick up your torch. Tab to look in your quiver. Well, that's neat. Whoops. I want that. So. Oh, the, the torch is in the quiver, too. That's neat. Okay. Let's walk through here. Oh, here we are. Alright, I know this bit, the, uh, this bit was in the trailer. Whoops, what happened? Alright. Oh, crap, I missed. wonder what happens if we lose all three shots. There we go. We won't have to find out. Oh, that's nice. I like that little, like, lens flaring action happening there. Look at that. That's pretty. Oh. Torch burned out. I'm gonna go back and relight it. Because <laughs> I'm a big scaredy cat. I want to have my torch light. light. There we go. Alright. Alright, don't fall off. Good. Alright, let's go. wonder how far you can get on one torch if you just really booked it. This way. 
Um, oh god. What was that? I think that was the Minotaur, guys. I think we just saw the Minotaur. And my torch just burned out. Oh god, I don't want to be down here like this. Green fire, that's not good either. Don't kill me, Minotaur. Okay, that seems safe. Let's go this way. I like those sounds. Oh, hello. Just another... Another stone guy. And another torch. What does this say? No, I don't want that. I want my torch. There we go. Last night they came in when I was sleeping. I was so certain I had barred the door, but I must have forgotten. Such a small mistake. When father comes, he will have them killed. I told them so, that, so and they laughed. Why would they laugh? It hurt more than the rest. The bones sing to me now, a wordless hymn. It helped me after they left. I just laid there and listened to it for hours. Creepy girl. I mean, I don't blame her. Sounds pretty terrible, but still. Hope she doesn't kill me later. Keeping an eye out for more arrows. I'm gonna guess that um, those are gonna be easy to miss. Oh, I hear the clippity-clop of minotaur hooves behind me. It's a big room. Bone song is within me now, and they can sense it. The melody vibrates just below my skin, and those monsters no longer dare meet my gaze. Last time they came for me, I gouged out the one of their eyes with my thumb. Now they keep the door locked and stay away. Father has me. Father has left me. He buried me with the other corpses. I hate them. I hate them all. Okay. I wonder if we can light these things on fire. Oh, we can. I don't know why it's green. But it's on fire. All for that. Is that a torch in there? It is a torch in there. Thank you for the torch. Alright, we got that. Down here. Oh, I don't like that. Just keep moving forward, I guess. I wonder who comes down here and lights all these. Oh, nice. Now we got crypts on the wall. No bodies in them, though. Uh, no more Minotaur sightings. It's all a bunch of rubble now. Mm -hmm. I keep an eye out for arrows and torches and whatnot. We can go down, or we can go down. You guys want to go down? Let's go down. Alright, what's around the corner? More down. And just jog a little bit. Like a little bit of singing or something. Alright, so we got a torch. And a page. This is Marcus. Buried Tiamus today. It had to be done in secret, but he deserved a place of honor for his sacrifice. I washed his bones myself and sent them down with the acolytes to be buried in the tombs under a false name. I cannot risk going down for a visit. But I miss her more than anything. The Hierophant suspects that someone amongst the lower priests have stolen her away. So far, his search has yielded no results. Oh. Oh, there's stuff in there. Alright, um... 
yeah, I'm going to stop here for today. I uh, hope you're enjoying it. Uh, if you are, please uh, leave me a like. helps me out a great deal. Or consider subscribing if you want to see more in the future. And I am the Kermit Archer, and this is Medusa's Labyrinth. Uh, thanks so much for joining me.